So what would you do if you came home and found strangers living there? That's exactly what happened recently to one island resident, but even more creepy is the fact that they knew his name and his neighbor's name. Island Moon newspaper publisher Dale Rankin has more tonight on what could be a squatter problem on the island. It is the topic of this week's Island Report. When Islander Paul Haynes came home from six months in Saudi Arabia to his condo here on the island, he got a big surprise. He found four strangers living in his condo. What was the first indication you had that somebody was living in your house? Um, I could tell the bathrooms had been used. And then things got really strange. And so these people knew my name and knew my neighbor's name. So these are not, these are not stupid people. They, these, these are good scammers. Yes, they're good scammers. They did their homework. They know who lives, the names of the people who lives in which, uh, which unit. Yes. What do they look like? Two, two uh, adult men and, and two young boys. After the first encounter, they left. But when he came home the second time, they hid in the attic. That's where they were. Yeah. And you could hear them up there. Yeah, I could hear them up there. He called the police, but by the time they arrived, no one could be found. But they came back. So you heard them in the attic and told them to come out? Yes. And yes. what did they do? They ran off the upstairs balcony and lowered themselves down to the deck and dropped off and took off next door. You just, just saw them running out the back of your house. And I heard one yell when he was climbing the fence next door and fell. <laughs> <laughs> he followed them next door where they went along a fence to an upstairs window. And I kind of lost them behind the trees because I didn't want them to see me, right? So I'm not, I, I saw them, maybe they just trying the window. Because at that point, I didn't want them to see me see them. But they went, but you saw them go run out of your place and go somewhere in this building. Yes, yes. And we don't know if they're still in there. Correct. We knocked on the door and there was no answer. But a neighbor reported seeing two men in a canoe quietly approach the house from the back. That's how quiet they were. There was no waves in the water. There was nothing. They came back down. Well, I was watching them at that point. So they came down, and they stopped right behind my husband's boat. So Paul has put in cameras and a security system, and if anybody is squatting in the condo next door, they're not answering the door. For 3 News and the Island Moon newspaper, I'm Dale Rankin, and we'll see you on the island. Squatters. Thank you, Dale.